Welcome back to another edition of Neon Trash. I'm your host, Tommy the Hammer, hanging out with Johnny Rocket, yeah. Adam McDougley's The Dreaded Drunken Gamer, Ooh, and who am I? Random Tosses and Walls right. Raymond. Yeah. He's not going to stick around, but that's okay, because we're hanging out, we're drinking, we're about to do a low-budget, independent movie review. We are going to watch Psycho Ape. Boom. Who's craving bananas? I, I guess... The, the ape. <laughs> the psycho ape. I don't know. That's just what it says on the bottom. Uh, <laughs> yikes. Uh, well. <laughs> Another ape movie. Here we go. Anyway, oh, um, I befriended uh, Addison Binnick. Sorry if I'm fucking that name up. Uh, met him years ago at uh, Cinema Wasteland. And he uh, actually does stuff with uh, the, the Troma movies, where he does kind of a mystery science theater sort of deal. And like I've been watching Addison like put out stuff on Facebook, you know, throughout the years. And I saw that he put out the movie Psycho Ape quite a while ago. I'm like, oh, that sounds stupidly awesome and yeah. awesomely stupid. Yes. So I've been wanting to buy it for a while, and Tommy. Picked it up for me. Hey, while he was a well, 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 well. So That's what friends are for. Yes. So Indeed. we're we're all going in blind here. Uh, yeah. It's a low budget indie flick. Uh, I guess it's a horror movie. Prepare yourself for the most intensely bananas motion picture of our time. Psycho Ape. Primate movies have come and gone. This is also a movie. Psycho Ape, a bloodthirsty banana butcher with revenge in his veins, stabbing his way into your heart. Can anyone escape the slaughter of Psycho Ape? The motion picture some people are talking about with a budget of pocket lint and a cast of verbal commitments, Psycho Ape will leave you breathless. Literally. Psycho Ape. So, it is a late night. We've been hanging out. It's like fucking almost two in the morning and we just got done watching the weird ass movie called Psycho Ape. <laughs> yeah. Thanks to this psycho ape. <laughs> hey. um, I've seen a lot of weird shit in my day. A lot of weird shit. Everything from trauma movies to 1950s drive-in films to uh, 1970s uh, Jalio Italian exploitation thrillers. Psycho Ape is on a, another level in its own world. Well, back in the mid-90s, me and Tom and uh, his brother and Dale, we used to make a skit comedy show, sort of, <laughs> called The Funny Channel. Uh, and uh, I feel like this is very reminiscent of some of the dumb shit that we would do, but like, it's actually structured pretty well. If anyone watches this movie and they say, oh, this movie is a fine cinematic experience. Brilliance! <laughs> they would be right and wrong at the same time. <laughs> because that's what it is. This movie is ballsy. It's experimental. It doesn't give a shit what you think because it's trying to be its own thing. And so in those regards, I think I could give the old movie Psycho Ape, I'm going six and a half, almost a seven out of ten. Definitely appreciate the filmmakers and just, you know, I mean, they're, yeah, Tom was right. There are zero fucks given in this movie. I mean, it's just, they just they go all out, they let it all hang out. I mean, it's just, it's perfect for a night of drinking with your friends. <laughs> this is just, yeah, it's tailor made for that. So, yeah. I mean, uh, it's just, yeah, it's obviously a cheap movie and it wears that on its uh, hairy sleeve, so to speak, on <laughs> fake ape costume. But, uh, it does just, it does it so enjoyably, and, and it's so much fun, you just really don't care, <laughs> so, I'm right there with Tom, I'm gonna give us like a six and a half, ah, <laughs> because yeah. like, I mean it's terrible, but it just, it it's, 
it's it's great. It just it, it really makes you enjoy it regardless. So I gotta appreciate that. I don't gotta appreciate any of this. <laughs> <laughs> that's what's awesome about it. <laughs> and, yeah, <see? laughs> yeah, yeah, it's it's just so it's so irreverent. It like comes full circle. Mm -hmm. Like, I mean, the only way I can really sum it up is to give the good old fashioned rocket star count and say these guys did a 10 star job of making a zero star movie. <laughs> yes. Yes. And that's really all I gotta say about it. <laughs> so what, uh, does that bounce out as five? <laughs> Maybe. At any rate, it, it was a fun flick. Like I mentioned earlier, uh, me and Tom and our friends used to fuck around with uh, the video camera quite a bit. And it... it <laughs> It uh, had a very similar feeling uh, to Psycho Ape. Obviously, Psycho Ape being a full motion picture compared to us just farting around. <laughs> like, uh, you know, it's on a different scale altogether. But it had the same sort of sentiment of, like, you know, it's stupid and. You're they, putting the they, most ridiculous ideas out there. And, and, and they just keep it. chugging along with that stupid idea. And it's just, it's a lot of fun. Uh, it went off the rails many a times, oh. and it's like, oh. uh, almost like, once it went off the rails, it's like, got pushed farther off rails, and like... Yeah, it wasn't just, on the tracks for a while. It just rolled down a hill, like, I don't... <laughs> uh, yeah, if you're looking for something crazy and stupid, and something that doesn't really make any sense, <laughs> and gory, and bloody, and terrible CGI, and... Weird 50s, 60s psychedelicness. Yeah, this is the movie for you. This movie is for you. Mm -hmm. Like, I, like Adam said, it's great for just drinking with your buddies. So if you need like, kind of a somewhat joke film for you and your friends, like, th yeah. this should be, you know, right on your radar. At any rate, uh, it's not, you know, film-wise, it, it's kind of weird to give star accounts for like you know, big budget flicks, and then, like, try to have the star count the same for an indie flick with follow no, different with, rules. with no budget. Yeah, yeah it, it does kind of follow different rules. So under the indie guideline, I'm giving it a... I'll give it a six and a half, too. Oh, oh. Six, six, six! Oh, motherfucker! Yes. Oh, motherfucker, yo! The number number, of, number of, the, of the banana beast! Of the yeah. banana beast! <laughs> Yes! Uh, you guys are bananas. Yeah, right? we are bananas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I don't know. This shit's stupid. With yeah. all that being said, guys, I hope we've been informative. Until, Until the next, next time, time, tune in to Neon Trash!